Hello everyone. My name is Greg and I'm the prayer coordinator at Northside Christian Church and today I'm going to read and pray with you from the Gospel of John chapter 1. In the beginning was the Word and the Word was with God and the Word was God. He was with God in the beginning. All things were created through him and apart from him not one thing was created that has been created. Life was in him, and that life was the light of men. That light shines in the darkness, yet the darkness did not overcome it. There was a man named John who was sent from God. He came as a witness to testify about the light, so that all might believe through him. He was not the light, but he came to testify about the light. The true light who gives light to everyone was coming into the world. He was in the world, and the world was created through him, yet the world did not recognize him. He came to his own, and his own people did not receive him. But to all who did receive him, he gave the right to become children of God, to those who would believe in his name. Those who were born not of blood, or of the will of the flesh, or of the will of man, but of God. The word became flesh and took up residence among us. We observed his glory, the glory as the one and only Son, from God the Father. Father, I thank you so much for your word, and I thank you that in the very beginning you already were. You were already here with us in the beginning, God, and that you had a plan, and that plan included us. Lord, you saw the end from the beginning, and in the very beginning, Lord, you saw that we had a place in your kingdom. We had a place in your family. We had a place in your heart, Lord God, and you created us to know you. You created us to have life and to have it abundantly. I thank you for your plans, God. How meticulously you put everything together so that we could become your children. How you sent witnesses so that we could know and believe that Jesus was the Son of God and that through him we would have life and salvation. And through faith in him, we could be redeemed and live with you for all eternity. Lord, I thank you for coming into this world, for intentionally placing yourself among your creation, even though for a short time they may not have recognized you. Many of your people do, and we are now your adopted children. We have received you, Lord. We have called out your name, and in accordance to the promise of your word, you gave us the right to become your children because of this. Father, I thank you that Jesus, the Word of God, became flesh and lived amongst us. And we look forward to the day when we can see him face to face. Thank you, God, for our lives. And thank you for our salvation. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Northside. Y'all have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow.